it's all kicking off. Everyone stands still. No one can get in. No one can get out. And the Dortmund fans are clapping. The players are clapping it. We've really seen it all today. Unbelievable scene. We're in a proper English pub here, the Black Lion, and I brought the German thug dad to the beautiful land of England. Here he is, Oliver. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, mate. How do you feel to be here? Great to be here. And uh, last time I was in London was 2013. We lost. We lost, but tomorrow we win on penalties. I don't want to disagree with Ollie because he's wearing the stony. Oh my god, he's got the badge in. I reckon they'll nick it 1 0. Yep. It's going to go to extra time. It's going to be 1 0 after 120 minutes. Chelsea on penalties. I'm confident we go through to the next round. As Monday night came to an end, we woke up to match day. We've been to Dortmund. Now it's time to end the story in Chelsea for their first ever meeting at Stamford Bridge. The pressure is high for the Blues. After a stuttering Premier League campaign, if there's any chance of a trophy, it remains in the Champions League. They received a glimpse of hope after their 1-0 win versus Leeds to break a six-game winless streak. But one goal won't do it versus Dortmund due to the aggregate score, making the odds to qualify as even for both clubs as it could be. But Edin Terzic has brought momentum. In the last 116 days, Dortmund have only won games, neither drawn or lost one. Bellingham, Julian Brandt and Schlotterbeck have been key players players this season. With expectations of fan marches and flares being set off, it's all to play for in West London tonight. Match day. Match Come on, brother. You've got the yellow <laughs> and black in. Feel the nerves. And it's not even my club. That's how important today is. It's Champions League. It's Tuesday night. Let's yep. go. We have made it. Putney Bridge. 3 1 for Borussia Dortmund. You confident? Yes, of course. We're going to beat them. Who's going to stand out? It's got to be Jude. In England. Uh, it's it's going to be Jude in England. He's going to be the one who's going to show up for, for his national team. And he's going to. He's a great guy. He's, he's the best yeah. English player as well. 4 2. 4 2. Ooh. Sunset. River Thames. Dortmund March. So apparently the away end, Germans about two and a half K, 3,000 max, and they brought about 5,000 fans. So it means twice as much have traveled without tickets. This march is insane. It's collected people from all sorts of pubs around Putney Bridge. We're heading towards the stadium, two and a half hours till kickoff. It's mad. That smell of pyro is coming through. Look at the reaction of the car. <laughs> Come on, he loves it. <laughs> He loves it in the range. He wasn't expecting this. Don't think she's too happy with him. Don't think she's too happy. She's not happy. What's your thoughts on the Dortmund fans? Uh, I'm not telling you. <laughs> Who do you support? Chelsea. <laughs> I'll say pretty bold, but I'll say 2-0 for, uh, yeah, for Dortmund. Maybe 2 or 3. The best thing is, is looking at the reaction from the restaurant. So they were just like, what the hell is going on? Two hours before kickoff, every Londoner is shocked, as you'd expect. So this is a true London experience. Cool. The march between the red London buses. That is proper. You're shit and you know you are a chance. From Dortmund fans. Oh shit. It's all kicking off. It's all kicking off here at the stadium. Everyone stands still. No one can get in. No one can get out. One out till kickoff, and nobody's there. They turn the bus in from another entrance to avoid all the crowds. So the team coach arrival with the Chelsea fans that's been sacked off as well. This is mad. I've never seen anything like this. Dortmund fans are over there. We made it into the stadium. Madness, absolute madness here, one hour before kickoff. I've never seen anything like this. Here's the East Stand for Chelsea fans. We made it inside, one hour till kickoff. Mental out there, and I'm sure it will be until the whistle starts. Where are you guys from, yeah? Switzerland. Yeah, Switzerland. Switzerland. Yeah, What's yeah, the yeah. biggest team in Switzerland? Yeah, 4-2 Chelsea. 2-1 Dortmund. 3-2 Chelsea. Good old pint of Singer. £3.50 here. That is an unbelievable deal. You won't get any better deal inside a football stadium. I've got a chicken bolt to fire. Let's give it a review. Oh my god. That's glorious. I think 2 0 Chelsea. Yeah? Really? I think, okay. I think we could get the job done. They're missing their striker. Yeah. And their keeper. I think 2 1 Chelsea. Yeah. And then 
Mudrick extra time. Look who it is. Hello? This Kavasa in England. Yes. Welcome, my friend. Thank you, bro. I think 2 1 Dortmund. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I'm super, super hyped for the match. I think it will be crazy. As you said, the wave fans are very, very good. It's going to be 2 0. Yeah. And aggregate 2 1. 2 0 Chelsea. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Um, far go. Easy, yeah? Get the job done 90 minutes. Kickoff's been delayed by 10 minutes. New kickoff time is 8 10. Dortmund fans are in. I think it's because the coach for the Dortmund players was delayed. That's why kickoff is delayed 10 minutes here. Full strength. Reese James, Chilwell, Kepper. No Mudrick in the first 11. Last time I was at delayed kickoff, it was Liverpool against Real Madrid in the Champions League final. Some efforts got into that. Here we go. A light show. A display in the shed. Chelsea fans in full voice. Welcome back to the round of 16. Second leg. Dortmund 1, Chelsea 0. 90 minutes to decide who goes to the last day. It's blue versus yellow and black. So. There can only be one winner in 90 minutes. Champions League night, bring it on. We have a display here in the away end. To lead out the team on the pitch. Things being thrown from the away end. I don't know how they've got so many flares in as well. There's another flare going on the pitch here. The steward's going to have to go on. There's another one. And the Dortmund fans are clapping. The players are clapping it. Booze for the Chelsea fans. We've really seen it all today. A Dutch referee today to kick us off here at Stamford Bridge. We've won it all chance. Smoke, yellow smoke to be precise as we get on the way. Do not see many teams come to Chelsea and put up a display like that. How they got it in, but what a display for kickoff. Raheem Sterling is through. Can he chip it? He's taking too long. Julian Brown looks injured here. Big blow for Dortmund. Dortmund fans do not like Chilwell. Eight minutes into the game, still no no. <laughs> Away fans. All bouncing together, yeah. surely from this distance is too much. Oh! Great save from Pepper. Havertz against the Germans. Yeah! Lino raises his flag. The German had scored against Chelsea. 38 minutes gone, no, no. That has to be it. Raheem Sterling. Surely. He's done it. He's done it. He's done it. That's the goal. Very lucky goal. Havertz was lucky there. Sterling as well, but we'll take it. There's a blue pyro that's been blown onto the field. We go into the 45th minute. 1-0. Half time. Chelsea won. Dortmund Hill, here are the stats. 41% possession, three attempts on target. Then Benfica is still winning 2-0. Aggregate score is 4-0. The Dortmund fans who will be worried because they know it's all back equal. Drawing again on aggregate. Chelsea won, Dortmund won. The second half is going to be very interesting. All up for grabs. One goal to decide it. No away goals now in the Champions League. One of the most important 45 minutes in football. Round of 16, second leg. Could be a pen. Cover. Potential penalty check. If Chelsea go through based off this decision, it's going to be unbelievable. Well, he's going to check it, but he's made his mind up pretty quickly. Penalty. Massive decision in this Champions League. Chelsea with a penalty. They haven't scored two goals in absolutely ages to lead against Dortmund. Finally, it's the German against the Germans. No, 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 no. The referee stopped the game again. The penalty might be retaken. Unbelievable scene. Oh my god. Penalty! Yeah! 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 
penalties awarded again. They've given Chelsea another give penalty. It. Dortmund fans don't know what's going on. I'm not sure if they're allowed to give it to a different player, but yeah. if they are, I think you should. I mean, yeah. confidence is after that. You missed the penalty. I mean, just give it to someone else. If you're allowed to, give it to someone else. Some fans around us supporting Havertz. Dortmund players have been complaining constantly. But nothing will change. The German against the German side once again. Here we go. Kai Havertz. Can he do it? He does. Massive goal. You, I didn't think he was going to score the second time. Yeah. Huge goal. Huge. Huge. The Matthew Harding. Knows what that's worth. 2-1 on aggregate to Chelsea. Dortmund fans still singing. 74th minute, still Chelsea lead on aggregate. Can't believe Chelsea have scored some goals and they've found their way. Dortmund are pressing for it now. Everybody. Is that enough time for Dortmund to equalise or would Chelsea go through? Let's find out. An additional time here, even the fans want it. The away fans are fired up. No way. End it here. Chelsea fans want it over. There it is. Chelsea, our last eight in the Champions League. Graham Potter is loving life. Dortmund are knocked out the Champions League. Really good Chelsea performance today. Dortmund weren't great. But again, on another day, that Royce free kick goes in. It's a completely different game. Wow. Chelsea fans have the final laugh here at the bridge. Scarves are out. None of them have left. They still respect what Dortmund have done. Cucurella, man of the match. And you know what? A lot of Chelsea fans doubted him. But he was absolutely brilliant today. Got stuck in. Made the right runs, played the ball in the right place, he was excellent. He's had a lot of stick recently, Kukurella, but he was fantastic today. We saw a march, we saw a delayed kickoff, we saw the rush, the flares, the smoke, and finally, a Chelsea comeback. I'm sorry to all the Borussia Dortmund fans that travelled across to England. They come back empty-handed and out the Champions League. Smash 20,000 likes and we will go to the next round. It was a special European encounter and a pleasure to share it with you guys.